Well, here it is. Uh, the transmitter. Let me get a light. It's a better thing. I'm sure it's noisy in here, huh? Well, anyway, the light. You can see better with it. There it is. It's the transmitter. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Well, it's getting about 800 watts output. All right. And see the modulator tubes on the left there. And of course the output tubes on the right. And it is live right now. See, I'll take that away and you can see the, kind of see how the tubes are glowing red a little bit. It's actually, those are some older out, uh, audio output tubes. So got to change that. Let's look at the meters here real quick. Yeah. Those look pretty good. Then I installed a ammeter right there. And it's right now looking about oh, like 4.2 amps. RF into a in, its own dummy load. And uh, so I, I don't know. I mean, it's not, it should be 4.6 amps. Up here. That meter isn't working right now, but this one is. That's the final plate and screen, uh, final plate voltage. There's the modulator plates. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, so it still needs a little work. It's not there yet, but uh, I am working on it. I can get the plate off button here. That's this one. And so you can watch the tubes as they the red glow diminishes. So, no. Everybody likes to see the tubes glow red. Oh yeah. I just shut off every the, the plate voltages and all that, so. Everything's off now. Still have some issues, uh, I think, with the output tuning network. Uh, I have to work on that next and get this thing up to full KW, but it's going to take some more parts. So we might be running it at 700 watts right now. I don't know. That's better than what we're doing now. So we'll see. That's it for now.